Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to be doing a quick demo for you guys on a 127 inch widescreen transparent and a 7.2.2 surround sound system by Clips. Now this is a part two video on a part one that I did for you guys a while ago. Kind of showing you guys my dedicated home theater room. On that video, I was able to show you guys the layout the specifics of the room and I also gave you guys a tour of the room but on this video here I focus more so on the backstory of this room I was able to look into the archives and I was able to gather a few pictures of um, what this room looked like before the construction so I'm able to show you guys the before during the construction and then after the construction so for those of you that are home theater enthusiasts like myself I hope you guys enjoy this content and um, again, before I get into this, please guys, like, subscribe, hit the notification button, and please leave a comment. Let me know what you guys think, because it is very important to me to know, you know, if you guys do enjoy this content. So without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and get right into this demo. Unfortunately, I'm not able to utilize the whole full potential of the widescreen, sadly to say. You can't let it take your power. Get to the book. There you have it, the demo on Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness. I know I said it was going to be a quick demo, but for a minute there I totally forgot I was recording, guys. I love this movie. I was going to go ahead and sit around and just watch the whole thing. But anyways, I'm going to do one more quick demo, and this one's going to be quick, guys. This one, I just wanted to show you the difference between the 16 by 9 how the movie looks on the screen on a 16 by 9 and I also want to show you guys what the projector produces on a widescreen picture. Now I'm using the Logitech Pro and just real quick want to show you guys how convenient this projector is. Now for those of you that own a 6050 I'm sure you guys know uh, what most people tend to have an issue with is the wait time to change the screen from one ratio to the other but for me I'll be honest I have no issues with that. It's very simple. You just have to have patience. And definitely I have patience. Now I don't have patience with this. Okay, there we go. So right now I have it on lens one. And if I want to go ahead and put it on widescreen, it's as simple as that. Lens two. Now what most people tend to um, nitpick on is just the fact that you got to wait a few seconds for it to adjust itself. But let's go ahead and wait. It's not long at all. And there you have it. Not even a minute. I want to say probably at the most is maybe anywhere from maybe maybe 10 seconds. You have to wait for it to adjust. And that's either widescreen or 16 by 9. 
So for the price point, the clarity of the picture, and it also comes with an extra bulb, I wanna say the Epson 6050, um, it's a no-brainer. But anyways, I'm not here to review that. Just wanted to show you guys and get into the second demo. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. another hot one no way home spider-man I, I can't tell you guys how many times i sat here and watched this movie even though i've seen it twice at the movies and then here at home i don't know how many times i might have seen it i almost caught myself again just sitting here enjoying the movie but that that scene right there was very impactful i'm pretty sure you guys can agree awesome um fight scene with the goblin and spider-man but um yeah there goes your two demos i hope you guys enjoyed it and we're about to go ahead and get into the showcase and um yeah man leave a comment let me know what you guys think and um i will catch you guys on the next one love the hobby love what you do peace